Hello and welcome. Within this video I'm going to be going through the installation process of Elixar's front and back film screen protector. Within this video I'm going to be going through the installation process of Elixar's film screen protector on the Samsung Galaxy S20. The process will take no longer than 5 minutes to complete. Once I've applied the film to the phone's display, I will be reviewing the overall look and the performance of the device with the protector attached. Before applying a screen protector, I would always recommend turning off your device, just so the display doesn't keep activating during the application. I would also recommend removing your fingerprint and then reapplying it after the film is placed. When purchasing the film protector, you will receive all the tools which you need to assist you when fitting the film. These tools consist of an application card, wet wipes, microfiber cloth, guide stickers and a dust remover sticker. First we need to ensure that the phone is spotless and dust free before we attach the film. So to do so, take the wet wipe and thoroughly clean the display of your device. Now, using the microfiber cloth, remove any excess liquid that may be left over from the wet wipe. Take the dust remover sticker and repeatedly dab the screen to ensure there is no dust. With this done, we can now turn our attention to applying the film. Pull back tab labelled 1. This will expose only a small fraction of the adhesive. Carefully match up the area to the top of your handset. Use the camera to help you align the film to the screen. Use the application card and smoothly run it along your phone, whilst holding the screen protector vertical, allowing the film to seamlessly detach from the plastic and attach to your phone's display. When it is completely attached, use the application card to firmly go over the film to make sure it is fitted securely. It is time to take label 2 off. Do this slowly and gently. If there are any bubbles visible, push them from the centre outwards so that the air can leave through the edging of the protector. Do not use the application card to do this, as you do not want to damage the ever so thin film. It is best to use the microfiber cloth instead. In order to install the protector to the back of the phone, follow the same steps. Clean the back of the phone until it looks pristine, then peel back label 1. Attach the exposed area to the bottom of the phone. It is vital that it is aligned correctly, as you want to make sure the cutout for the camera lenses fit perfectly when applied. Use the application card and smoothly run it along your phone. Now remove tab 2, then completing the process by wiping over the film using the microfiber cloth. Your phone screen is now protected from scratches, allowing you to withhold the pristine condition of this valuable handset long after purchasing, and as a result of the film's oleophobic coating, it reduces the chance of fingerprints being visible on your display. I have found no difference in the response rate of the phone after the application, making it just as easy as before to scroll through the phone, allowing me to effortlessly look through the web. After the film's installation, it goes unnoticed on your screen, allowing you to attach a case to amplify the protection of your phone. By having this film protector on the front and back of your handset, you are able to keep the visuals of your device intact without having to add any additional weight or size to your phone. Though if you are prone to dropping your device, I would definitely suggest using a case as the film protector is unlikely to combat heavy impact collisions. The film is crystal clear, which means you can see the full potential of the magnificent quality of your phone screen when watching movies via your device. I feel the installation process was fairly easy, considering the results of the final product. The film is slightly more tricky to apply than glass protectors, though I believe this method of application made it ever so simple. If you would like this form of screen protection for your S20 or S20+, Plus, I have posted the link as to where you can find it in the descriptions and comments below. Let me know in the comments section what your favourite screen protector is. For more content regarding tech reviews and mobile accessories, please hit our subscribe button. Thank you for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.